His grandmother saw it over a hundred years ago, and it was when she was moving around um, in the forest looking for pigs that she saw a black object, and she noticed that this black object suddenly became very large, incredibly large. It was terrifying. And she knew that this was the Yeti. We're translating and then translating and then translating, so all kinds of stuff gets kind of stretched and weird and not exact, right? But clearly we're getting the impression of the blending together of the legendary Yeti, the god of the mountain, and the real Yeti, the animal that runs around in the forest and might, you know, attack you or eat you. So it's interesting, because I, I, I can just pick out little bits here and there before it all goes through the system. My plan is to gather as many different interpretations as possible, then blend them together. Got the pointy head, and you're showing like, like that. This is interesting. We're all drawing yetis, right? And there's many different kinds of yetis, but they all have that pointy head, which I think is really interesting. Check it out, huh? Yeti number one by the Rinpoche. As I work up my drawings to take home to Florida, I realize that for these people, this isn't a mythical beast. I'm actually drawing an animal that they believe lives within striking distance of the monastery. We know that there is a legend that the Yeti is in these forests, around us. Is the Yeti considered to be a protector of the forest? Yes, it is. When the Yeti is seen nearby, it's good for the monastery. We know in 1959, the Yeti disappeared. It just vanished, and that was the time when the monastery was destroyed, along with many others in China. But now the Yeti is back and the monastery is flourishing. Since 1989, the Yeti has been seen twice, and the old lamas think this is good, because when the Yeti is nearby, its spirit protects the monastery and the sacred lands around it. When was the last time anyone saw the Yeti? It was in June last year. A woman saw it near the monastery. Oh, last June. OK. But you should be all right in the daytime as the Yeti only eats people at night. This is it. Amazing. Valley of the Yeti.